on the last episode of Journey to a New Home. What do we do now? So, we finished all the ground at midnight. Just kidding. Living room, done. <laughs> Today we are waiting for the appliances to come in and while we wait we're just doing random cleaning jobs throughout the house because there are people coming in and out of the house then these next couple days I can't exactly clean the whole house mainly because I don't know do normal people wear shoes in houses now even during the COVID era like can people just not wear shoes in the house because that makes sense right but I can't always guarantee it, so I'm just preparing for the worst. I don't want to clean and then have foot tracks in the house and then have to clean again. So, yep. Today we're going to be starting some cleaning with the carpet and Danny's going to unlock the carpet cleaner, which I am super excited about. What day is it? What? <laughs> is it day four? <laughs> Didn't we start on Friday? Yeah. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. It's day four. I forgot the video yesterday. It was too chaotic. What happened? Um, we got our appliances yesterday. So we have our refrigerator and our washer and dryer. We may or may not have some problems, but it's okay, we'll get it fixed. My sister came over yesterday to check out the house and that took up a bit of time, so another reason why I did a video. And now, he's doing the blinds. <laughs> and the best part is that I'm pretty sure we don't have to cut almost all of them. But majority of them, they don't need to get cut, which is awesome. Yeah, pretty tight. So it's good I have them in cups. Oh, yes. Better? Yeah. Okay. So, sure. right, is that cool? Yeah, that's good. I like how there's no cords. Nice. Would you have a little Maybe. Yeah. Depends, I guess. <laughs> you can't get it all the way. I can't get it all the way, but... <laughs> See Danny's handiwork. Ooh. Ah. And he did it all by hand. Without that. <laughs> I also picked up lunch. I forgot to show what we ate, but we had Mexican. It was delicious. <laughs> My belly's on fire, but that's okay. So when you received the fridge yesterday, what happened? So, they were putting over here, they were taking all the, all the plastic, and then I see a defect, and I'm like, hold up. You guys look at this, but to the two guys. Mm -hmm. They're like, oh man. <laughs> and they said, well, we'll leave it here, and you can call Lowe's, and they'll figure something out. So we just did that. If Rochelle shows you, it's pretty hard to see. Up, like at certain angles can you kind of see it okay so, so like on this side of the stainless steel you can see my reflection yes and it's all like smooth lines like going all the way down but as soon as you go over here there is a 
break in the reflection. It's like, you can tell that the metal is bent right here. Like you see that reflection, it's like broken. Can you see that babe? Look in the camera. Yeah. You see the broken re yeah, like a reflection? That's, that's where there's right like, here. it's not a dent, it's like an opposite of a dent. We call it a bubble. Yeah. But it's not 100% perfect. So what happened after that? So yesterday I called, they said, oh, they're gonna wait to see pictures after the guys, the delivery guys come back with the ticket and then they're gonna let me know how much of a discount they'll give or to replace it. Um, they didn't call back, so today I called, I said, hey, what's up? They said, my bad, we'll give you 20%. <laughs> <laughs> All right, they said it'll be 20% back. So I did the math for just the fridge, it was like 17, 1,700, so 20% um, was like 340. So they're like, all right, we'll do that. And before I could say that the lady, or I told the lady, like, let me do the math real quick. Um, before I could say yes to the 340, she was like, okay, it'll be 813. <laughs> I said, okay. <laughs> I didn't even ask her anything. But uh, basically she did 20% off the whole order, which was this and the washer and dryer. So we got this fridge for, Instead of 1700 it was 900 for the fridge. Yeah. And the price for the fridge was on sale. It was already on sale because the it was originally was 2400 Yeah. Yeah, so. Save it for, yeah. You know, stuff like over a thousand? Yeah. Damn. Yay! And now Danny is going to do the commemorative plastic peeling. If it comes back. Oh. I meant inside. I know. This is plastic. I'm gonna do this later. <laughs> what? We don't even have like shell over there. No wonder we're not gonna do it. I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> it's actually so nice. Well, we have leftover food, so he has to peel off all the plastic so we can put the food in there. What are those? Oh, for the side. All the plastic in the fridge is officially gone. Good job, Danny. And now we have our Mexican leftovers and some random water. So now, we're about to go have dinner. Update before I clean it up. But we came home and the fridge was leaking. When I mean leaking, I mean literally flooding down. Oh man, into the closet too. Yeah, just a little bit. Into the hallway. Oh, wow. Oh wow. <laughs> Super wow. Wow, this is really bad. <laughs> No, because I think it really is that too. Yeah. And it's like when it only happened today because we turned off the ice maker on top. Which still has the dirty water. So you think it's clogged? That dirty water. Yeah. Well, because you can run hot water through it, but I don't know how, like can you pull the thing out? We don't have hot water. Oh well. <laughs> Hello. That was wow. <laughs> That's all I can say. Just wow. <laughs> Good thing I bought an extra pair of socks. So yeah, there was a river on our downstairs floor, <laughs> all the way from our kitchen to the front door. And um, yeah. <laughs> In the middle of all the chaos of me trying to use a squeegee to like fling the water out of the front door, I was just like, I don't know how we're gonna get all this water out before it causes damage to the house. What are we gonna do? We had a blanket, a few blankets, and a uh, drop cloth we were using as a big squeegee. <laughs> Just pushing water out towards the front door slowly. 
Oh my god. But that water was like at least like that deep. No, yeah, you Which is it. a lot. <sighs> but like in the middle of all the chaos, I was like, I think I want to call your sister Danny. <laughs> or like, do you think that they'll let us borrow towels just to like mop up the floor? And then he's like, I don't know, I don't know. You can if you want, you can ask them. I was like, I think I'm gonna ask them. <laughs> like, this is pretty bad. And so I call his oldest sister and I was like, um, so our house got flooded. Do you have any towels that I can borrow? <laughs> and she was like, your house is flooded? Okay, stay there. I'll be right there. <laughs> and then like 10 minutes later, your brother-in-law, your sister, and your mom showed up. <laughs> and they came with a shot back, which is amazing. That was a total lifesaver. Yeah. <sighs> and towels. We didn't even have big towels here. We didn't thing. have any big towels. We had rags and blankets. And they came in clutch with the towels. Mm -hmm. And then they used the shot back to vacuum up all the rest of the water. Just troubleshooting the fridge. You were troubleshooting the fridge with your brother-in-law. And I guess you guys figured it out, but... We'll see. After we defrost it tomorrow, yeah. I'm gonna run the water <laughs> before like ice gets the chance to build up. So then it's just like draining through the system. We'll see, honestly. I don't know. But we have to pull this back out and then use the shop back behind it because... Oh, okay. Um, I would also have towels ready. And... Yeah. Shout out to Danny's family for helping us. Because I don't know what we have, we would have done. That would have taken maybe an extra half an hour to clean everything up. No, and then, at least another hour for sure. Really? Yeah. <laughs> and then you with just towels? Oh yeah, that was. And then all the towels were just like soaking wet. There were just shirts and small shop uh, towels. Shop towels, yeah. And then we're just the blanket that I had in the car. <laughs> Thanks, fam. <laughs> okay, gonna go home now. <laughs> This day it's over.